hello guys welcome back to a brand new video today and welcome back to another episode that's what's going on at Brighton Live Albion and um, the differences between this and Seagull Daily is it's not news on the club this is just my personal opinion and um, who I would like to see in the summer so guys you know what to do subscribe for more thanks for watching and let's go so this episode's all of free agent People have been let go by their uh, current club and I think could do a bit of us a favour in the up and coming season. So I'm going to start off with Danny Welbeck. <laughs> Give me a minute to explain why I would like to see him in the blue and white jersey for this season. Um, okay, I'll, I'll read this bit of information. Why well, I would like to see him in, the, in our I think our soul would play and our standard would play would suit him. And don't forget, as a club, we are starting to look up. Well, I hope we start to look up anyway, instead of down. So, this one we like Daddy Welbeck in our um, team. He's 28 years old. He's got two FA Cups, two Premier Leagues, one Champions League, all under his belt, and a few more besides that. So, you know, he's got quite a few titles under his belt uh, I don't think he really got his chance at Arsenal so you know I think he deserves another chance and he's only the age of 28 years old for a free agent that ain't too bad uh, you know all we, have to sort out, all we have to sort out is his wages so um, the main the main position he plays is centre forward Glenn Murray's position um, I've already mentioned in a couple of videos about uh, Friday replacement Especially the likes of Tom Hammond and Glenn Murray, uh, you know Danny Welbeck could look for could be in there, um, but he could also be our ten-minute man as well, you know. So that's why we like him in there as well. His other positions is a right wing, a white, a white winger and a left winger. Got there in the end. So a uh, Sonny March and uh, Anthony Knockhart's position for say. X Arsenal and X Man United, two teams that's been in the Champions League, why he's been at these current clubs. Uh, you know, so I don't think that'd be too bad a signing. And he's got one goal and eight appearances from this season in the league. Uh, you know, still sticking my young philosophy. There are a few players in here that's, you know, coming to the end of their careers, but I still wouldn't mind them in the blue and white jersey of Brighton this coming season. Uh, my next player is. Gary Cahill, ex uh, Chelsea, well he will be um, after his contract runs out, 33 years old, he's got two Premier Leagues, one Champions League, two FA Cups, and as I said the main position is centre back, um, you know, uh, I think someone like him, especially the rooms that are going around at the minute, he'll be a great replacement. As I said, these players don't have to necessarily play, just their experience could help our club in a long way. So, you know, let's see what happens. Um, my next player is Roberto Monreal. Um, sorry if I mispronounced his name, I most probably have. You know who it is anyway. Uh, age 26, still in his mid 20s. Um, he's, he's a left back. He's, he's other position is a left midfielder, he's a left footer, he's an ex Liverpool and Seville. Um, but age 26 for a free agent, well, I think we'd be mad to miss out on him. I know we've got Bong, I know we've got Bernardo, but to have that third replacement as a 26 year old, as just wages just covers, as a free agent as well, so it costs us nothing. I think we'd be mad to miss out on someone like that. Um, I've seen him play quite a few times for Liverpool. I think he'd do a cup well. But let's, to, you know, as I said, I think the club needs to go for some of these players. These are all free as well. Um, I might have already said it in the video, but these are all free just in case I miss it going through the players. My next player is Sammy Nazari. Um, ex Arsenal, ex Man United. Um, 
you know, he's got two Premier League titles, two goals in five appearances this this season. His main position is a CAM, so a pass of Graves uh, replacement if Graves gets injured. Uh, I think a lot of our thoughts from last season was when Graves was out, we had no one like, really to replace him. I think Samuel and Azra would be a great shout. 31 years of age, so yet again, pushing the end of his career, but yet again, his experience will do our club justice, I personally do think. Ex-Arsenal, ex ex-Man City as well. You know, he's got, he's played Champions League football, he's been there, he knows what it's all about. Um, but I'd like to see him in the blue and white jersey. I know, I know before you don't start shouting, I know we're not going to sign all of these, but just to have maybe two, three of these, plus our sign up money signings, I think our club would be in for a great season. Um, yeah, uh, back to Samuel Nazari for a bit. He could play, he could play in the left or the right uh, wings as well. Yeah, get another knock out of Sonny Mars position. He's a professional right footer, and as I said, an ex Man City and Arsenal uh, player. You know, that is not too bad, um, personally, for a freebie, anyway. Um, my last player. And I know I've missed a few. If you'd like to hear more of free agents or personally like to sign, all these players have been released by the clubs as well. So, you know, they're going to have no trouble getting them. Um, put it down in the comments below and I'll do another episode on it and uh, I'll do that for you. Um, anyway, my last player Antonio Fidencia. 33 years of age, he's got two Premier League. Uh, titles, one FA Cup, main position right back, yet again Bruno replacement, Bruno did retire at the end of this season, so um, I think, yet again his experience, his Champions League experience, his Premier League experience will dr drift us will drift us a long way um, I'll keep on mentioning the word experience I do apologise, but I just think some of these players will be absolutely brilliant at our club, uh, especially for, hopefully uh, I hope our board's looking up uh, instead of behind us. But yet again, we can't have a season like we did last season. So this one mentions some of these top players. Um, right back to uh, Valencia. Right back, so as I said, Bruno position. He could play on the right mid and right, uh, right wing. So yet again, not cut position. Uh, right footer, x Bang United. Now, as I said, you want to see another episode on this. I mean, I've missed players like James Wilson, for example, Daniel Sturridge. Um, you know, and I could find other players that could possibly be well in our club. Uh, but a few of them players, put your comments down below. Would you like to see any of these players in the blue and white jersey for the next season? Uh, the season's drawing closer. There will be a, a video coming up this Thursday. With the new Brighton away shirt, um, you know I'll review it like I did the home one, and also we get our Premier League fixtures released as well. So you see my reactions to that. But I'm going to bring this video to an end, guys. You know what to do. Give us a big fat thumbs up if you enjoy it. Subscribe for more. Thanks for watching. Ciao for now.